a 1979 $1 coin sold for over $15,000. Here's how to tell if yours is valuable. An overflowing change jar is a sign that your coins need a new home. This can mean moving your spare quarters and dimes to a bigger jar, or even better, checking to see if you have any valuable coins that collectors love. One coin to be on the lookout for is the 1979 $1 coin. Also known as the Susan B. Anthony dollar, this coin features a portrait of the late women's suffrage movement leader and is worth thousands, reportedly once selling for over $15,000 at an auction. Keep reading to find out the features and qualities of a 1979 $1 coin that turns it from change into serious cash. What is a 1979 coin and why is it special? The 1979 $1 coin is unique because it was the first of its kind. Following the end circulation of the Eisenhower dollar, there was a concern over the lack of diversity in the faces and figures portrayed on America coins. So, President Jimmy Carter signed the Susan B. Anthony Dollar Coin Act into law in 1978. This act made Anthony the first woman to appear on a circulating U.S. coin, which was minted from 1979 to 1981 and then again in 1999 to fulfill a renewed demand. The front of the copper nickel coin features Anthony's likeness, while the back depicts an American eagle landing on the moon. Starting its first year of minting, these dollar coins were produced at U.S. mints in Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. This is why you'll see a mint mark with a P, D, or S initial on the front to indicate where the coin was made. How many 1979 $1 coins were made? In total, the U.S. Mint produced 888,842,452 Susan B. Anthony dollar coins for circulation. Interestingly enough, the majority of these coins were produced in 1979, a whopping 757,813,744 to be exact. One potential reason for this dip in annual production is the limited operating capacity of mintages in 1980 and 1981. Regardless, 1979 $1 coins are still in circulation and remain a coveted item among collectors. How do I know if my 1979 Susan B. Anthony coin is valuable? Speaking with an appraiser in person or online is ideal if you're looking for the precise value of your 1979 $1 coin. Several factors can help determine that value, and the financial experts at Benzinga shared four on their website. Condition. In general, collectors usually seek coins that are in excellent, uncirculated condition with very little signs of wear or damage. A 1979 $1 coin in superb condition is likely to attract higher prices on the selling market. Date. Fewer. Susan B. Anthony dollar coins were produced between 1981 and 1999 compared to 1979. This makes them more scarce and potentially valuable but 1979 coins are still sought after as they're part of the first-year production process. Mint marks. Mint marks on 1979 dollar coins can be found on the front of the coin to the right of Anthony's portrait. Coins with a D mint mark are more common, which makes them less of a commodity compared to coins with P or S mint mark. Mint errors. Coins with mint errors are beloved by collectors as they make them stand out from the rest. Pay attention to quirks in the design, duplicate images on the coin, or other irregularities that make the coin odd in a good way.